Isak Paredes, Detroit Tigers' top prospect for Austin Meadows, who's dealt with mental health issues, so hope he gets right. You know, he gets, gets right. right. But this guy has come over, played third base for them, and crushing the baseball. Yeah. And what I love, and we're going to get into it, I would have loved the freedom. Some of the coaches, I'm re diving in on him, Chad Matola was my hitting coach with Toronto. He's now the hitting coach in Tampa. Kevin Cash. They call him in the office and they say, we don't want a ball right side of second base. Can you imagine being told, like, like my stock swing, Chipper Jones always used to say this, what is your stock swing? What did you do in Little League? Where did your homers go in Little League? Were they pulled or were they right center? And mine was always right center, so he's like, build off that. Guys can't execute pitches on the black in. So fight, control that outer half of the zone and do what you do well and build off that. Right. Isak, they saw something in him where, hey. It was the opposite. Complete opposite. J.P. Crawford's trying to do it. We, we've chronicled a lot of guys that have started to pull the baseball. Nolan Arenado talking to him during the WBC. All his homers are pulled. So oh, I want, Arena. they have freed him up in Tampa to kind of be himself. And you watch on a nightly basis. If you lock in on the Rays, we can get into the tape. He is roasting foul balls at the third base dugout. All over the plate, he's got big time power. And like I said, this was a top prospect with Detroit Tigers. This wasn't somebody who didn't have a big time skill set. But pause this. Bring up the weighted runs created plus leaderboard. I love diving. Eric Nays does such an amazing job presenting these guys to me at times. Would you have guessed this? Wow, wow. Look at that. <clears throat> I Look mean, at J.P. Crawford. American League, exactly, J.P. Crawford on that board. Luis Robert Jr., his kind of overshadowed because of their team's demise this season. But Isak Paredes on pace with Yandy Diaz, Kyle Tucker, Seager, Shohei Otani. And, and, and for, the, for people at home that are watching, 100 is average. 100 your average big league your player. 100 your average, 138% better than, than your average big else. league ball player. So what did he look like in Detroit? Well, one thing I'm seeing there with his stance, and if we can go back to that video, go to the is screen. Leave look this. how on top of the – he knows where the party's at. I mean, he, he's on top of the dish. Comfortable in his Comfortable, zone. upright. It's constant tinkering, constant adjusting, right? Like sinking into your lower half. You're a younger guy. He was trying to fight. Now he's feeling – Comfortable, Sex. got a little sexiness to him, feeling good. And then maybe he struggles, maybe he wants to get back in his legs. The constant adjustments Bro, that you make. Zero, but I'll say this. As you get older, you start realizing where the party's at. Like, you start realizing contact point. You learn contact point. You learn you learn what they're For trying him, to do For him, it's certainly out front. For him, it's out in front. For him, it's knowing the game, the, the counts. Because I've seen him also pull some breaking balls. And if you're on the fastball in to pull, you're not going to hit breaking balls. Look at the hands completely in a different. He's got space. Oh, man. Go, go back there a little bit. Go back there. Right right there. When you can see, for kids at home that watch themselves in college or anything like that, if you're watching the camera angle from the pitch from center field, you were talking and your to load, me this about Manny. I remember If that. you can see your hands. When you're at your contact of you're, point, you're, you're stuck. You, you're stuck. You, you got no space. I, I mean, if I'm going to throw a punch at you and I have to go here, it's, it's just a long way to get there. Now, if I'm going back, I'm stronger, I'm in a better situation, pulling, and I got more, more punch in my, in my hit. All right, run this. And of course, in, on this one on the right, we're going to show his one hit to right center. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> bring, bring this up. What, what yeah. Hit? So, Miles Michaelis, I mean, that ball is black away spinning, and he <laughs> goes out and hooks it. I used to watch Mark Teixeira do this, playing first <laughs> base for the Texas Rangers. He got on the dish, and he made everything pull. Working with Jimmy Rollins the other night at TBS, same thing, on the dish, and he was trying to yank balls pull side because he knew. He couldn't drive the ball the other way as aggressively. Pause this real quick for me. Bring up the next board. Highest pull percentage in the entire sport since 2022, Isak Paredes. Max Muncy, Ozzy Albies, another guy on the dish pulling. Max Muncy. You know, one Give thing me a spray about, chart. They all got really good eyes. Wow. Look at this. <laughs> Holy moly. I, Look at this. But you have the, Robert, you have the freedom the Tampa Bay Rays are telling you 
this is what we Go want. ahead. This is how you help us. So mm. can you imagine being unlocked, getting in your car every day, knowing exactly what's expected of you? It has to be a, a freeing feeling as an athlete. I didn't know, you know, do I get three hits tonight? Do I find myself back in the lineup? They open up a door that, that forever, for him, he'll be thankful for. Yeah. Get but, back into the tape here, because it's nice. Oh. Okay, so That's the reason I'm going to show some misses right here is when you're thinking for him up the middle the other way. He's in a nice position to hit that ball. But when you see this time and time again, and it's not getting out, talking to Nolan Arenado, he talked about something similar. He's like, I can take my little double to right center, but I always felt I never was able to drive the ball out consistently that way. And you're seeing balls die on the track, so what do you do? I'm tired of that. I'm pulling. And, and the good ones know to right is low and to pull is high. Most home runs to pull side since the start of 2020. Nolan's up there. Look at Nolan right there. Look at Mookie. Mookie. He's made a concerted effort. Get on the dish, get into his legs a little bit more. But Isak Paredes, the Tampa Bay Rays do it all the time. Look at that. Foot down. You know, you would think Very the simple kick, move. Simple move. I mean, that's consistent. You can see the baseball the whole time. Pause it right at contact. Go back. When anytime you got your hands above your barrel, that's a good swing. Palm up, palm down. Oh. That Give me that last shoulder. board. Give me the line drive board before we get out. That's I nice. thought this was 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 telling, right? And they show you these numbers. Why would you try and hit the ball the other way? Splits yeah. on fly balls and yeah. line drive since the start of 22. Look at his slug pull side. Look at the exit velo. He doesn't hit the ball hard the other way. Wow. The best thing about him, though, is he understands his swing because you don't think the pitcher knows that, d -Row? The, he's pitcher, the pitchers know that. Pitch and yanking it. The problem is he's yanking, but he's very aware of what's a ball and what's a strike. Yeah. Because for you to do that, you got to be aware of the lines. You got to be aware of the corners. He, he, he's got it. He's, he's figured it out. Eric Nays, another amazing job. Really, he said, uh, really eye opening. Dive in there. on Isak Paredes.